Hello everyone, I'm Don Neely and welcome to Name That Song. This is a presentation put on by the Owl Brothers on a monthly basis and last month's winner so far is no one. But here's Frederick Hodges to tell you all about the song. Hello, last week's song was called You Can't Be a Friend to Everybody. Written in 1908 by Joseph E. Howard with lyrics by Will M. Huff and Frank R. Adams for the musical comedy Honeymoon Trail. This was a Chicago-based show rather than a Broadway show, but it was a tremendous success. It toured the country, garnering rave reviews wherever it played, except, however, in Sacramento, where the reviewer in the Sacramento Bee pronounced it vulgar, inane, disjointed, inconsequential, cheap, and tiresome. Everywhere else, however, it was praised to the skies. Now, the racy lyrics make reference to the WCTU, which, as I hardly need inform any of you, stands for the Women's Christian Temperance Union, the Reform Society largely responsible for the introduction of prohibition in the United States. With that, I now present you with You Can't Be a Friend to Everybody. You can't please Mrs. Grundy and taste life's deepest joys. And if you're strong with all the girls, you're in wrong with the boys. A glass of beer will queer you with a WCTU. But if nobody drank a drum, what would the barkeeps do? Oh, you can't be a friend to everybody. And you'll have lots of trouble if you try. Listen to the angels sing. Then perhaps you'll learn the reason why. There's a place that's concealed beneath the necktie where you'll get what they handed out to me. If you try to be a friend to everybody. One night you meet a pal of yours who's holding up a wall. He says, if you don't help me, friend, I can't get home at all. You think his wife will worry, so you do the best you can. But when you get him home, his wife is with another man. Oh, you can't be a friend to everybody. And you'll have lots of trouble if you try. Listen to the angel sing. Then perhaps you'll learn the reason why. If you do help him home, she'll get in trouble. If you don't, he'll get twice as much as she. Oh, it's hard to be a friend to everybody. A girl and man driving in the forest chance to see a tiny little kitten that was caught up in a tree. Please help me down, she asked him, and he shinned up the trunk, for at the time he didn't know the kitten was a skunk. Oh, you can't be a friend to everybody, and you'll have lots of trouble if you try. Listen to the angels sing, then perhaps you'll learn the reason why. Now he talks to that lady through long distance. That's as close as she'll let him come, you see. Since he tried to be a friend to everybody. Thank you very much, Owl Brothers. Thank you, Frederick. That song was written by Joseph Edgar Howard, and he wrote many songs, but uh, a lot of them were with his wife, Ida Emerson. They formed the songwriting duo Howard and Emerson, and wrote many hits, including Hello, My Baby, uh, which was a 
1999 song that was featured in many, many mediums, including movies and television. The most famous is probably a Warner Brothers cartoon called One Froggy Evening, uh, directed by Chuck Jones. Uh, In the film, a frog named Michigan J. Frog is singing and dancing, but only when a man is not asking him to. And it went a little something like this. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Send me a kiss by wire. Baby, my heart's on fire. The song also made an appearance on Mad Men, The Office, The Simpsons, and in a Mel Brooks movie called Spaceballs, sung by an alien with a straw boater and cane. As to why nobody was able to name the song, well, you know, to be honest, we were getting some comments on the previous seasons uh, that we weren't doing songs that were hard enough, uh, or maybe we were doing too many easy songs. So I decided to throw in a really, really hard one. I really didn't expect anyone to get this. Uh, But... You know, it's fun to learn new tunes. Uh, If you want to learn this song, you can check out the details section of this video where you'll find a download to the original sheet music, um, which is in 6-8 time on piano, and uh, the version that we did in the video, which is in 4-4 time. Our rendition of that song last month uh, was more in the style of Lou Waters, and uh, kind of has a Big Bear Stomp feel to it, if you know that song. The verse is in minor, the chorus is in major, but it has a four-bar section that kind of says, hey, remember me? And it quotes a little minor section um, that kind of sounds like an Irish drone goes, listen to the angels sing. And then there's an answer to that call uh, by whistling. Kind of a neat little touch there. There are a total of six different chorus and verses in the lyrics. Some of them are better than others, but it's actually a very fun song to make up your own lyrics to. There's several situations where people might get into disagreements, so have fun with it. The most important thing is, although maybe you can't be a friend to everybody, remember to be nice to people. (laughs) A great thanks to Frederick Hodges, Steve Apple, Marty Eggers, and Don Neely. Check out Frederick's website at frederickhodges.com. You can see him play with Don Neely's Royal Society Orchestra, along with Steve and Marty, and myself and Justin. Check out Name That Song, Previous Seasons, if you want to learn a new song. It's a great way to do it. I've been doing this for for years and uh it's one of the best ways of just finding out what's out there subscribe like we'll be back next month with a new video bye see you next time on name that song